G'day, my name's Stuart Chignall and I've been living adjacent to the Wombat State Forest for most of my life. And I spent so much of my childhood amongst the trees and by the creeks, I think that played a big part in why I became an ecologist and then an environmental consultant. And today I wanted to talk to you about a proposal to convert the Wombat State Forest and a bunch of other state forests into national parks. Now if that happens, camping like this, hunting feral animals, amateur prospecting, and a bunch of other activities will no longer be allowed. And if you're an environmentalist like me, you might think that's a good thing. But counterintuitively, it, it's really not. If you remove those communities of people out of the forest, you take with them all their eyes and ears. And less people using the forest is going to mean more people abusing the forest. Because as it is, we've got people who have no second thoughts at the moment, taking a chainsaw, going out and cutting down a beautiful tree like this one I'm standing next to, because they want the wood and they don't give a damn. And there's a whole stack of people who live in the town surrounding these forests who care more about avoiding paying tip fees to get rid of their rubbish than they do about the bush. And it, it boils, boils down to the less people you have using the forest in ways that have minimal or no, or in some cases, a beneficial impact, the more of those people, law-abiding people who care about the forest, the more of those that are excluded from the forest, then the more people you're going to have here abusing the forest. So if you're someone who, up until now, has thought that this was a good idea, you need to get in touch with VIAC and tell them why it's actually a bad idea. As counterintuitive as that may seem. And you need to tell them that we need to encourage more people to use the forest so that there's more people, more of the good people here who care about the forest out looking after it. And if you're someone whose current way of enjoying the bush would be outlawed, by these changes, you definitely need to get in touch with VIAC and tell them how it would be bad for the bush. But if we get excluded from it, we're not going to be here to look after it. And if we're gone, there'll be more people in here abusing it.